hello, 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 Virgo, Libra, Cusp, Cross Watchers. Welcome everyone to my channel. I am Tierra Love. How are you all doing? Okay, so Virgo, Libra, Cusp, Cross Watchers, it's time for us to get you all some messages in regards to your love connections for the week of May the 14th through the 21st, okay? All right, I hopefully um, we'll find some messages here that will be helpful to you all. Please know that these will be general messages that may or may not resonate with all of you beautiful individuals, okay? If you find messages here that resonate, please feel free to take them with you. If you find messages here that does not resonate with you at all, then just please do leave them here on the table to allow someone to pick them up that they will resonate with, okay? All right, y'all. So here I got your overall energy of the connection. We're going to clarify. Well, we're going to see what's going on in the connection. Um, clarify that energy. Get you all some confessions. Uh, we're going to get the feelings between the two of you and top it off with some advice. Okay. All right, y'all. So the overall energy of your connection for this upcoming week is freedom. All right. So, when we can be our truest selves, we are then able to freely love, okay? So, the overall energy of the connection is for the both of you all to just feel free to be yourself. That way, you'll be able to freely love and, you know, you'll feel like it not to it's not so hard for your person to love you because you're being yourself and so you're going to attract someone that loves you for you okay all right so let's uh get some messages towards the connection here uh tell us what's going on with virgo libra cusp and their love interest for the week of may the 14th through the 21st okay all right here okay so what we have here you all you got quality time someone is wanting more quality time um you all maybe have been sharing a lot of quality time here with each other but we're going to clarify this here but the quality time that you all share together is a very nice loving feeling and Maybe you are wanting that at this time, okay? You got solitude and self-love. Solitude, self-love. So someone here in this connection maybe needs a little solitude so they could feed themselves with that self-love. The self-love that is needed in order for you to go out and um, know that you are loved, okay? All right. Um, you got karmic partner here so maybe you think you're dealing with a karmic partner maybe a person might be dealing with a karmic partner maybe this could be uh the topic of you all's discussion okay so we're going to clarify here this energy and you got a surprise here so there is going to be a surprise of some sort um in this upcoming week okay all right so let's see let's clarify this energy all right tell us more about this freedom the overall energy of the connection all right this quality time okay solitude and self-love here hold on all right this karmic partner tell us some more about the karmic partner all right and a surprise here okay all right y'all so with this freedom clarifying this energy here of you all freely being your truest self or yourself you got the unknown so the unknown scares your person, all right? They see the abundance you bring in their life, but they fear being wrong. So it could be your person that is maybe afraid to be their true self, to truly be who they truly are. They could be afraid maybe that you're not going to um, love them, okay? Uh, with this quality time you got coldness here all right so they feel you pulling away 
they wish they can pull you back and convince you that they are worth keeping all right so someone here wants the quality time but the other here is acting a bit cold okay and and you're feeling the distance uh, between you and this person all right now with the self-love and solitude you have release here so um, when they set you free, they felt the sting from your absence. Don't let their silence fool you. Okay, so if you're not hearing from this person, if you're wondering, um, don't let them not speaking up or them contacting you. Don't let that, you know, kind of make you think that they are not missing you. Okay, now with this karmic partner here, you got innocence. So it looks like your innocence, your kind heart. Um, they see that in you and they are trying to protect you from, you know, who they are, okay? They're trying to protect you from themselves, all right? And also unsighted. So, they are unable to see the complete extent of the toxicity they brought into the connection because that's all they know, all right? So, your person could be dealing with a karmic partner or a karmic person and they're trying to protect you here from, you know, the situation here, okay? They do realize that they are a bit toxic and, well actually they un they're not able to see the complete toxicity of who they are or what they brought into the connection okay because that's all they know here all right now with this surprise you got mixed signals here so that cloudy space between hot and cold is their way of telling you that they're not totally sure if they're into you or not okay so this person is sending mixed signals when it comes to you being truly happy here with this person okay um they don't quite know what they want at this time let's get you all some uh confessions okay all right so i keep reading our old text messages okay so this person keep going back reading old text messages i want to make things right between us okay so these are their confessions they want you to know that they are thinking about you they are a little afraid they could be in a situation that they have to break free from from okay and but they you know, they don't want things to be as cold as they are between the two of you, okay? So, let's see. Let's get some more clarity. Tell us more about this quality time with the coldness. All right. So, you got secret love here. There is a hidden love where you all could be meeting in secret here, okay? But, um... Maybe you're feeling like that this person is being cold towards you. Maybe you feel like this person is keeping you a secret. And, you know, um, yeah, you just want, I guess you want some clarity here. But let's keep going, okay? Tell us more about this solitude with release. All right, you got the gate is closed. It's not the right time. So until someone releases whatever no longer well until someone sit in solitude give themselves some self-love um then it will not be the right time i guess for this upcoming week okay um but they do miss you all right okay so now let's look at this karmic partner you got listen so your person here maybe is having a hard time listening to their heart here you gotta listen so you gotta listen to the songs of your heart maybe this is for you you gotta follow your heart here okay but this this person is kind of like scratching their head you know and maybe is having a hard time with balancing the heart with the mind okay so i have to follow the heart more here okay now with the um yeah the surprise uh oh surprise you got time with friends friends introduce you to a new love and y'all my bad with this karmic partner you got given a gift here so i don't know you could be receiving some type of gift in this upcoming week and maybe some communication coming from your person okay um 
and friends could be introducing you to a new love in this upcoming week i don't know maybe you're going to be sending out mixed signals because maybe you haven't moved past this situation okay so but let's get some feelings between you and your love interest let's get some feelings all right you got the feminine energy here saying I want you, I crave you, I long to feel you again. I won't tell you that, I want to show you, okay? Also, feminine energy here. I will contact you soon, I will. That is my intention. I can feel you giving up, so please expect the unexpected here, okay? And the masculine energy here says, I feel like you weren't willing to make me or us a priority. I won't beg for your love and attention. I deserve the best. Okay, so the masculine energy is feeling like um, you didn't make them the priority here. Okay, so let's get some advice for you. All right, so you have sacred space here. Okay, so it's some time, time out. Clear your energy. Space will help bring some clarity here. What flipped over is boundaries. So there are some firm boundaries that are needed now at this time. Okay. Maybe to protect your uh, feelings. Okay. To just put up some boundaries. We need boundaries, y'all. Okay. You got true love. So this love is emotional, physical, and unconditional. All right, so this is this this is your true love, or you feel like this is your true love, or this love you all do have, you all are connecting on an emotional level, a physical level. Okay, this is a feeling of unconditional love. Okay, but maybe someone does have to break free out of a situation that they were in. Uh, prior to meeting you here okay and you have trust here so it is safe to trust in this situation okay all right so continue to be yourself and y'all these are your messages i really hope that they will my bad y'all i really hope that they will be helpful thank you all so much for joining me um, I salute the divinity and you all. I am sending you all so much love, so much light, so much positivity. And I'll see y'all next time, okay? Bye.